Hello everyone. Well I'm back with um, a project that I made up from a kit from Marlow from Grace's place. Um, I started this earlier this week and um, I told you I'd try and put something together. So what I've done with a little rabbit kit. It's the smaller of a kit I think um, but I used quite a bit of the, the fabrics and I've got a little piece of rabbit fabric left over so what I've done I've made a little a little bunny book um, the flower that she gave me um, in the kit I used on the front um, I wrapped it with some of the little pearl trim that she she popped into the kit um, the only thing I've added to this um, is some uh, white cheesecloth and I've used that um, throughout. So this is just a little a little book. Bunnies just uh, and the flower are actually put on with um, little velcro circles. The spine's just got some gathered cheesecloth and the back is plain. And this is using the pink uh, Rodrion glaze again in the kit. Now this is just a wrap around round cover uh, tied with um, organza ribbon from the kit again. As I say it's just a wrap around and this is the little book that I made. I'll just give you a quick flick through. So here we have um, on the on the first page, <coughs> sort of a patchwork of uh, the different types of fabric in the kit. I added some uh, again some white cheesecloth. So I had a little bit of machine embroidery here and here, here and here in green. So that's page one. Second page, just a little bit of hand embroidery there. Uh, this is in pink and grey and white. Uh, there's a little pocket there in a little white embroidered pocket. Um, a little flower with a button on, one of Marlowe's rabbit tags. I just popped a couple of buttons on the ends of the tag. A little bit of uh, ruffle trim there. Uh, here I've just got a little snippet of uh, the rabbit. I've got an odd little uh, bird button, so I'll pop that on because all the colours matched. Uh, here I've just padded a little piece in the centre, wrapped it with some uh, twisted uh, pink fabric and I made a little booklet, popped a bunny rabbit button on the front and it's just got little pages in. Page uh, with the resin bowl from the kit. So I've gathered up some tulle. Um, a little bride I popped on there. I made a, just a little tag out of two pieces of fabric and I put some uh, tulle on the back and just some machine embroidery stitches. And in the top I made a pocket and the bunnies in there. This page um, 
I'll just lay down some white cheesecloth and some white embroidery. Picked out some of the, the flower heads really in beads. Let's just take the tag out and uh, where is it? It probably seem better. Uh, just some pink beads, grey beads, silver beads. Just picked out at random. Oh, there's a bunny tag there. And I've made a side pocket there. So that's that page. This one I just uh, lined the page in this lovely fabric with the bunnies on. I love it. Um, pop this on the centre again with a. Uh, I don't think there's any glue on this at all. It's all either hand stitched, machine stitched, or these tiny little Velcro buttons to pop it on. Uh, this page. I actually used a piece of the um, wrapping paper that uh, some of the items were enclosed in. So I made a little pocket out of that, stitched it on, uh, put three little buttons on this uh, scrap piece of cheesecloth, gathered up some of the pink Brodery Anglaise there, and I made a little, just a little card put some bunny fabric on there, machined around it. Right. So we've got a pocket on the top here. a side pocket here and with a little bit of um, uh, ribbon trim that I'd got left I put on a little spool. There. Here just some uh, pieces of the fabric in the kit, just cut little squares and uh, machine them down onto the uh, cheesecloth backing and again there made that a pocket and another of those lovely tags beautiful face on that bunny I love it uh, here we've got um, a little pocket just made a little what you'd call that. Just made out of a bit of paper and some of the fabric. <coughs> Three mini envelopes. Actually did stick those down. Um, put little buttons on. And some uh, bobbin embroidery around there and there. This one um, Just all machine embroidery, but not bobbing embroidery, it's just machined on uh, some grey flowers, they're upside down, a butterfly, some cross stitch, a couple of buttons, and some little stars. That uh, flower, flower pattern picked out around there. And bunny. And this little uh, resin flower, I didn't know where to put. But I like the fact that there's something stark and then the flowers on there just breaks it all up a little bit. And then there's Bunny again, another tag. But I've uh, put a bow on this one. And the back page, uh, just a little uh, a ball pin with a little bit of fabric and a button. Um, a Brodery Anglaise pocket with a little bit of rabbit fabric and here I've put a, a tiny little book and the little book I've velcroed on as well so that it doesn't fall out 
just a scrap of uh, material on the front, a uh, little bit of fabric, paper, fabric, paper, and a bunny all the way through. And that tucks back in the pocket. So, and that's the end of the little book. But um, it's surprising what you can make out of a small amount of uh, material. And I think that's came out quite well. It's quite pretty. Uh, as I say, it ties with the organza ribbon that's in the kit. And I think that's a sweet little, sweet little book. Um, I've got some more kits of Marlowe's. Um, I've got to think up some ideas for those as well. But I hope you like that one. And I hope you like it as well, Marlowe. Just a sweet little thing that you could do with one of her kits. So thank you for watching ladies and uh, enjoy the rest of your day. Bye for now. Bye.